JDTV Broadcast Productions Scotland, the home of great Scottish drama. Okay, so it's the iPhone 5S um, with the Otterbox uh, casing. This is a lime green, I think it is. This is the one I got a long time ago. This isn't by any means brand new. I mean, I've had this a while now. You'll see the unboxing uh, video of it somewhere on my channel. Um, I should have done this earlier on when it was more daylight, but not to worry. Uh, this is uh, the carry case and the belt clip that clips on the casing. So you can just clip that onto your belt or your trousers or your y fronts or your boxer shorts or you can even clip it onto your willy. It might hurt though. Right, so it's an iPhone 5S, the latest one, until they bring out the iPhone 6, which will just be the same phone with a couple of add ons. Well, I mean, then again, it might not be. Maybe they'll give it a bigger screen, who knows? Um, I'll just adjust the brightness here. Don't usually have it as bright as that. I mean, I usually just do that, I turn it all the way down. Yeah, that looks better, doesn't it? See, sometimes when it's too bright, it kind of buggers the camera up. Um, the weather today, well, we're nearly in spring now, so it's getting a bit better. Uh, 9 degrees centigrade. That's all in centigrade. Of course, Australia at the, at the bottom there is getting the best temperatures. Uh, 21 in Turf, 14 in Melbourne, 23 in Sydney. And of course you can switch that to Fahrenheit, if that makes sense to you. I know it doesn't to me because by the time I went to school they had done away with Fahrenheit in this country. We call that the old way. It is the old way because I mean if you're an old person you were brought up in Fahrenheit. Um, but when I went to school it was all sort of decimalised and uh, centigrade. You know, so we don't use Fahrenheit in this country, but if you're a really old person, you'll know what that means. And I know if you live in, in America or Canada or, or elsewhere that, where they use it, you, you will know what it means. But, you know, nobody uses Fahrenheit anymore. It's, it's a simple fact. Uh, unless that's what you were taught at school, then you'll know what it means. But, you know, for the most of people, we don't know what it means anymore because... We don't use it anymore. We use centigrade. So you've got to respect that. You know, whatever you were taught is what you know. There'll be some people out there that don't know what centigrade is, but or Celsius. Call it what you want. It's the same thing. But uh, I'm not. Going, I'm not here to argue about that. I was actually going to show you the case. But uh, no, seriously, what I'm going to be doing, right? Um, now you know Sony's Sony's got a new telephone out. It's uh, 4G, of course. It's uh, the Sony Xperia Z2. Uh, this phone is great. It's got like a 5.2 inch uh, screen on it, and it's dust proof. It's waterproof as well. You can go swimming with it. You can go under the water and film. And not only is it got an HD camera, it's also got Ultra HD, um, which is 4K resolution. So, wow, right? So I'm, go I'm going to be testing that telephone out very soon. And um, I'm actually going to be doing a competition, the first one on this channel, and giving away two of them. I've got two of them I'm going to be given. I don't have them today, but I'm, I will be have two of them and I'm going to be giving them away in a competition which I'll be running next month, which will be April. Right, so let's just see. It's kind of hard when you've only got one hand. I don't have this on a tripod, so I didn't clip it right in so I could get it out a bit easier. So that's how that looks in the Otterbox case. Now this is a three layer case. It does give the iPhone lots of protection. It's got a built-in screen protector, so you don't have to rush out and buy a screen protector and start sticking it on. 
which actually already I did do, but I actually just peeled it back off again. Uh, this is a lime green one, they come in different colours. So you've got like um, three separate parts to this case. Where you can see the green, that sits on in two separate shells. And then you've got the big rubber uh, bumper which goes right round it, which makes up the third part. You know, and you've got your mute button there. It covers it up. You've got your speaker, your earphone, and you've got your charging socket there. Um, for your lightning, thunder, fart cable, as I would call it. Um, and you've got your wee Apple logo at the back and your camera, your main camera and your front facing camera, you can see everything's all protected and there's a wee logo OtterBox so if you're looking for a case actually for this telephone I would go for this one focus is shite on this today black of light terrible isn't it, but there you go um, I may have a look at this without the case actually and say look this is how it looks without the case. But uh, I'm sure you know, I'm not bullshitting you, it is an iPhone 5S, because you've probably seen my unboxing. And as well, if you look at the button here, you can tell by looking at the home button, it's not one of the old ones, because one of the old iPhones, uh, the, the home button on it is completely different from this. That's the fingerprint scanner. Um, in fact, if I just put it off, no, I don't want to do that because then I would need to put it back on and I'm using my right hand and my fingerprints on my right hand and if I go to my left hand, I'll need to put my passcode in and I'm not showing you my fucking passcode. Okay, so... Uh, yeah, that's good too, and that's good. Do you want to see my TV app? Hang on a minute. Yeah, love for them, Netflix, Sky, BBC, iPlayer. Um, but this is a good one, this is for free. This lets you see the telly. All the basic channels, if you're out and about. There's all your BBCs and your ITVs and your Channel 4s and 5s and all the rest of them. Your free view channels. Don't actually have STV on the list, which is a shame, but ITV will need to do. And it's got some adverts on it. Is the day someone is going Just to one of these things. Ten thousand three hundred pounds, and that could be you. And for your chance to win that ten thousand three hundred pounds, just answer today's question correctly. With which of these inventions is Alexander Graham Bell particularly associated? Oh, Alexander Graham the Bell. Camera, the telephone. The uh, sorry. Yeah, telephone. telephone. I was going to say the TV answer, there. Oh, no, no, Another. While I'm here, people, right, let's sort this out while I am here. Alexander Graham Bell, born in Scotland, invented the telephone, okay? John Logie Baird, born in Scotland, invented the television. I'm not even going to talk about penicillin. Or tarmac, or the gas lamp, or the steam engine. Go and read some history books. But what I do, Gangria, is when people come in and say, No, it wasn't. It wasn't him. It was an American that did that. Fuck off. You people are so fucking ignorant sometimes. Right, so. There's BBC One. Uh, it's a good we have that, that's a uh, TV a player. Now means you have the opportunity to make right, so join me when I'll come back uh, with this competition to win one of two Sony Xperia uh, Z2s. 4K camera, waterproof, uh, you probably can't afford to go and buy one, if you can don't enter the competition because then you're just being a cheap cunt. And we don't like cheap cunts here on the channel. So have a nice day and we'll see you.